look. I got inspired by a picture that I saw on Instagram. I'll post it right now. So I thought that makeup was very inspirational. I decided to kind of revamp it and make it more my style. So if you guys are interested in seeing how I did it, keep on watching and I'll show you how. Right, so I'm starting off this look as usual with Soft Ochre Paint Pot from MAC. I'm gonna be placing it all over my eye. Excuse my unwaxed eyebrows. They are not in the best condition right now, but please forgive me. I'm gonna start on my eyebrows. I'm just taking an angle brush with my Brow Duo from the Sharon and Kelly collection from MAC. And I'm gonna give myself a little bit of a stronger eyebrow and a little bit more squared off in the beginning. All right, so I'm gonna start off the look after my eyebrows done with the 15 pan warm palette from MAC. And I'm going to take, I'm gonna take Saddle right there. Just a really neutral warm brown on a big fluffy brush. I'm gonna start buffing it through my crease as my transitional shade. Um, when I get to the outer part of my eye, I'm going to make sure I kind of close it off and kind of bring it around. I don't want that side to be blown out very much. I want most of it just to be by my eyebrow and in this part of my eye, the center kind of portion of my eye. From that same palette, I'm taking brulee. Is that brulee? It sure is. Okay. Brulee, and we're taking that underneath the eyebrow just to blend down that saddle. I'm switching over to a smaller brush. This is a 217 from MAC, a really old one. <laughs> I'm taking Dark Brew from the palette. It's basically like Sketch. And I'm gonna take a little bit of that and we're gonna put that through the crease. Again, keeping it on the outer part of the eye and a smaller circumference. Taking that Dance in the Dark color and we're just bringing it down to, through the beginning of the nose. Kind of creating a shape. Almost like a pointed shape right there. I'm taking another fluffy brush and a color from MAC called Strike While Hot, which is basically a red. So at least at the beginning of the bridge of my nose. Now I'm switching over to a flat brush. This is a 242 from MAC with that same red color that Strike While Hot. And I'm going to be packing that on to the outer and the inner part of my eye on just the lid. Alright, so now before we move on to the middle part of the eye, we're going to work on this inner tear duct. So I'm taking the NYX Dremel Pencil in Milk that I've depotted with a little script brush. And what I'm going to do, it's going to be hard to get on camera, is make this little like line up and around and into the crease starting from the tear duct. And also what I'm doing is I'm bringing it down and I'm bringing it over into the tear duct and a really little um, kind of cat eye shape. All right, and I'm gonna set that before it kind of smears all over the place. I'm, gonna, I'm using Pick Me Up from the 15 Pan Neutral Cool Palette. And a small brush and we're just gonna set that pencil in place. All right, so what I'm gonna do now is take my saddle color, that same warm brown that I've been using, and we're gonna put that underneath the eye. And a pretty far, pretty far down. That same strict wall hot color. and then a matte black. Now 
Now I'm just taking my Kat Von D liner and trooper. I'm creating my points um, on the inside and on the outside corner. And then I'm taking a red gel eyeliner and be putting on the inside of my eye. Alright, so now we're gonna work on the actual eyelid. I'm taking a sky blue pencil from MAC. This is called Skyscape. I'm going to be coloring it on the moving part of my eyelid. I'm taking a pigment from MAC in Soft Wash Gray. It's just a really light bluish gray kind of tone. And I'm going to be pressing it on top of that pencil eyeliner. I'm taking some Mixing Medium from MAC. It's an eyeliner one. I'm going to be pressing in Reflux Transparent Teal Glitter right over top of that blue. Alright, so to finish the look off, I used my Dark Golden Mineralized Skin Finish for MAC. For my cheeks today, I decided to use a NARS blush in Liberté. Liberty? Birthday. One of those. And then as a highlight today, I used the MAC New Vegas Skin Finish. It was from the Alexander McQueen Collection. And on my lips, I used the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Widges. And then in the center, I tapped that uh, MAC Transparent Reflex Teal Glitter right in the center. And that was it. Hope you guys liked it.